Mississippi Beer Reviews, New, Rain, uh, New Belgium Ranger IPA. This is made by Coors, just like the uh, New Belgium Fat Tire. So, I guess this is Coors' attempt to make an IPA. I'm a big fan of IPAs, so let's give it a shot. It's 6.5% uh, alcohol by volume. It is an IPA. Tip your hat to our beer rangers in the field who inspired this well-balanced IPA packed with Simcoe, Cascade, and Chinook hops. Count on citrus aromas and piney surroundings. Well, that is a, um, <clears throat> a good selection of hops. Simcoe, Cascade, and Chinook. So, <clears throat> and a 6.5% alcohol just like the, uh, the Sam Adams uh, Rebel IPA. Also, guys, I'll put my gamer tag up here on the screen. Hope you can see it. Just in case any of you guys want to play some Madden 25 or something on Xbox One, Crosscut Con 5 is my gamer tag. Send me a friend request, and we'll do it. All right. A little bit of smoke hanging around there. A little bit of butter on that from the fridge. Another highlight bar glass. Let's give it a pour. Oh, I'm catching the. Oh, yeah, I'm catching the pond from here. We've got a slightly off-white head. We've got a semi-hazy gold-colored appearance. Let's give it a smell. <sighs> Smells like an IPA. You can smell the hops, some of the piney um, grapefruit accents in it. A little bit of sweetness coming in. All right. Cheers to uh, a Coors brand IPA. start off by saying this. IPA up front piney rush that just completely dies down at the end and smooths out. Tastes kind of like a um, I guess like a Coors Banquet sort of. It definitely dies down. It does leave a little bit of the grapefruit, piney hoppiness on your tongue. It's um, that feels medium. It's um, it's not an IPA. It's disguised as an IPA. I think I'm even picking up some corn adjunct in there, to be honest. Which, I mean, doesn't make this beer bad, but it's not what it's supposed to be. <clears throat> you know, the big three, um, you know, Bud Miller Coors, they're trying to dabble into the, the craft world by putting out stuff like this. Which this is, I mean, this is a good step into IPAs, I would say. It's not an IPA, but it's disguised as one. Um, 
if you want to try some good IPAs, but you know you're still stuck on you know say uh, American lagers, American adjunct lagers, I should say, this will be a good step up here. <clears throat> I mean, as far as taste wise, I mean it, it tastes great. I mean it's um. Tastes like an IPA, but kind of smooths out to an American adjunct lager, which I, I'm a fan of both styles. So, I mean, I, th I think it's really good, but because it's not what it says it is, I mean, I'm not going to give it an A because um, it is not an IPA. But at 6.5% alcohol, you can't really taste a lot of the alcohol. Mostly you're getting your, your hops, maybe a little bit of the barley. I think most of the barley is disguised by the hops. Nice thick color of foam. Just leave them there. Um, For what it is, guys, um, I'm gonna give I'm gonna give it a B minus. I think it's well above average as far as taste. Uh, I'm not gonna give it any higher than that because it's not what it said that it was. But overall, I think it's a very enjoyable beer. Um, I think it's definitely worth a shot. Uh, you know, depending on price, I got this in a a, a mix six. Pack, so I couldn't really tell you how much you know it would be just to buy a six pack of these but uh, if you want an IPA that's not <clears throat> too heavy this would be a good way to go um, I'm still a fan of the Sam Adams Rebel IPA but um, that's pretty good I I'm gonna give it a B minus guys thanks for watching y'all um, don't forget to comment like and subscribe Y'all keep your uh, requests coming. If you request a video, I will be sure to do it. Thanks for everything, guys. Look me up on Xbox One Crosscut Con 5. And let's see if we can play a little Madden 25. Oh, and I called the Dallas Cowboys. Nobody else can pick them. Later.